When I came to Penn State, I got an opportunity. I wasn't a five-star recruit by any means. I was a zero-star recruit. I think knowing who I was and knowing that I had to give more to get, whether it was the minutes I wanted or just to continue being part of the team. I always share this with, with recruits or anyone that asks me. Um, if they want to get to the next level. Uh, my only advice to them is just know who you are. That's my superpower, I think. Harold works on Edie, double clutches, not a lot of room, whistle, and one, and one. basket counts to the foul. I got nothing pretty about my game. Sessoms cuts through off to Harrod, juggles, controls, and scores. I'm not Steph Curry, I'm not shooting threes, I'm not putting the ball behind my back between the legs, right? Nothing pretty about it. I'm just trying to clean up on the glass, like the old 1970s games. An offensive rebound, Hera. There was no more John Hera play than that one right there. He made a play against Michigan State where he was an animal, unguardable, like he was just all over the place. Got it back, scored it, and he is fouled. What an effort by the senior John Hara. And me and Sam Sessoms looked at each other like, whoa, that was impressive. Gritty, not pretty. Gritty, not pretty. Gritty, not pretty. That's how we've kind of played this whole season. Opportunistic on offense. Tried to out-tough people, we've tried to defend just win in any way possible. And he eats that phrase up. I remember after one of our games, he had gotten his tooth chipped. He flashed that smile, looked at me, he was like, gritty, not pretty, coach. <laughs> Working on getting better right here, 20 minutes. 20 minutes, let's get better. Everybody talks about the great players, right? The guys that score thousands of points but it's the guys that are everyday guys are the guys that really set your culture. Switch it, extra slow pick. Ready to stun on this pop, John. Stun it, good. John is the foundation of this program. I thank the staff before me for bringing him here because I get the benefit of having him for one year. And that one year of him is enough to build a program. Penn State gave a lifetime of blessings to me, so I try to give to this community half of what is given to me. Could I do the uh, peachy paterna and some a coffee refill? Sure. I brought last year's freshman to the creamery, bought him some ice cream. I think it's important that you see your teammates outside the basketball court and you can just have conversations about their families or what they do over the summer. Awesome. Thank you. You're welcome. That's part of being a senior. Everything he does is genuine, and it's from his heart. When you talk about selfless, that's who he is. We had a former manager um, who was a Four Diamonds kid, and Four Diamonds is an organization that helps with Thon here. Thon is student ran. It's a dance marathon. I think it's 46 hours long, and there's about 600 dancers, and they fundraise for childhood cancer. $13,756,374.50. I thought it would be a cool idea to bring a Four Diamonds kid up to the game and design some shoes for him. I am Declan from Hanover, PA, and I'm nine. I like John Heron because he's super good and he wins a lot of games for Penn State. He can dunk and he goes like that. And every time he gets an and one. I first met John Harrow at a Zoom with my um, work for fun. <laughs> He's celebrating five years cancer-free very soon. Doctor, do you like basketball? Yeah. What position do you play? Point guard. <laughs> Point guard? I wish I could play. <laughs> Keep doing those ball hands. It makes you better. I wish I did that. As a family, 
we watch a lot of games and we always enjoyed watching him play, but especially after he Zoomed with the kids, I just think he's a fantastic human being because he was so great talking to them. I have a high school teammate who now designs shoes and they, just, they look awesome. They say his name on them and he loves squirrels. So it's a Penn State logo, like a Nittany Line logo, and then it's like a mixture of a squirrel and they're white and blue, they're pretty cool. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight we celebrate our 2021-22 graduating members of the Penn State Basketball Program. We got us tickets and we're sitting like the second row or whatever, and shoes with squirrels on them. He does know that players move on, but Declan's definitely hoping that John gets to play in the NBA so that he can continue to watch him. I'm just excited to see what happens at senior night, and I think it's great for both of them.